What's happening, guys? Hold on, I gotta fix my camera, because me touching it made it go all fucked up and shit. What's up, guys? Um, as y'all know, this morning I got a my first gift <laughs> from YouTube. I'm still a little bit... Or, I, I, I'm guessing it's from YouTube. I, I don't know who it's from. Or, I know who it's from. I just don't know where the hell it came from. How he got my email address, or my, my home address, um, and all that crap. I have no idea how he got it. Um, that part's a little bit, a little bit creepy to me. Um, I'll be, I'll be honest with you. <laughs> but, um, you know, it's, it's whatever. It is what it is. It's cool. Um, I definitely enjoy it. Um, maybe I will put out my uh, my mailing address and all that stuff so you know if you guys want to send me anything you guys can um, again you know uh, you guys have like my text now number um, and all that stuff so if you guys ever want to text me or whatever you know you guys are more than free so far I haven't gotten any text which is fine um, again it's you know I, I technically only put it there for emergencies but you know, if anybody wants to talk outside of, you know, commenting on my videos, you know, you guys are more than welcome to. Um, so just let me know who, who you are and uh, don't don't try to start any shit. I got too much drama going in my life right now. Um, you know, I got I got pussy ass people talking crap about me uh, behind my back saying that, you know, this sickness that I had for almost a year and a half now is fake even though I flatlined and was dead clinically dead for uh, over seven minutes you know a year ago but I'm faking it so yeah uh, quite literally I uh, made a comment or made a post on on Facebook about it <clears throat> basically calling everybody out and I'll I'll even say the what I posted basically Guys, I've been working since I was seven years old. Um, these people, they're saying that I'm lazy and I can't hold down a job and I have no work ethic and all that shit and you know, whatever. Uh, it basically calling me lazy. Um, again, I've been working since I was seven years old. I started working on my uncle's farm at the age of seven. Uh, I worked there, or I basically worked, worked, quote unquote, helped him out with you know, the farm until, I don't know, I was 15, 16 years old. Uh, when I was 14, I started helping my parents uh, clean a church um, and all that stuff. Um, while doing this, also playing sports, you know, playing football, basketball, you know, basically anything outside, riding bikes. <clears throat> and then, along with that, um, I was also, um, uh, or no, no, I'm sorry, pa past that, um, you know, uh, I graduated, which, uh, I'm sorry, but these people cannot say, uh, these people that are talking stuff about me has n not graduated high school. Uh, they may have a GED, they may have, you know, uh, went, went to... Uh, after they got their GED, went to you know college, uh, which is fine, uh, but they never graduated high school. So, uh, but I'm lazy and I'm stupid and I'm an asshole. But I'm the one that graduated high school. Okay. Um. Oh, and I went to Votech for machining. But I'm an idiot. You literally have to know calculus and trigonometry and geometry and a couple other things for a couple other stuff math mathematical wise in order to do ma uh, machine work you know but I'm an idiot okay um uh after I graduated high school um and I was actually legally allowed to have a job I literally had three at one time um Oh, by the way, I'm recording on my on my cell phone and my camcorder. So, I if you guys see me doing this, yeah, you know why. Um, 
<clears throat> and uh, but yeah, I had three jobs at one time. Um, four if you count. I started helping my parents again at the church. Um, once I, I lost two of those jobs at uh, uh, one day. The, the one job was seasonal. The other job just shut down. Uh, and then the third job, the guy was an asshole. And it, yeah, it just, I'm not even going to get into that. Um, but after that, I went and I started working at a healthcare clinic and I was literally there for 10 years. I was a maintenance guy there for 10 years, but I can't hold down a job. Um, but I was at a job for 10 years. Uh, the longest that any of these people, except for one person, but the longest that any of these people has had a job was uh, three weeks to, I believe, three months was the longest that any of them had held a job. Uh, but I was at a job for 10 years, but I can't hold down a job. And after I left there, I went to uh, a pool and spa place delivering hot tubs. Hot tubs weigh... You know, anywhere from 200 pounds to 3,000 pounds, depending on what hot tub you get. Uh, some a little bit more. Uh, but I'm lazy. Uh, <laughs> and uh, shut up, Phoenix! My cat's meowing. He's a loud mouth. And um, uh, after I left there, they screwed me over. I tore my bicep. And they went and put me back in the delivery truck. That's why I left there. After I left there, I went to a roofing place. I got dicked over there. Left there. Went to uh, a drill drill bit packaging place. I literally switched positions there to maintenance right before I left there to come down to the barge company by my house. These people begged me to stay. They begged me to stay because... I was a hard worker, a good worker, and a good work ethic. But I'm lazy. Um, I was down here at the barge company until uh, for just just shy of a year. I was literally there. I started April fifteenth, uh, two thousand nineteen, and I ended up literally leaving there. Uh, March 24th, 2020 was my last day, last full day. I went in on the 25th and they sent me home, said I was uh, exposed to the COVID. A couple days later, I got extremely sick and here we are. Um, no, I did not. I don't think I had the COVID. I believe personally I had it in December, January, whenever I first initially got sick, but still, I, I don't, I don't know. Or not December, January, January, February, whenever I first initially got sick. And then I was just having side effects from there. But I don't know. Um, the reason why I told you guys this is because I know that they watch my videos. And um, I think it's funny. <clears throat> and uh, a couple of them are starting rumors. And I, I'm going to say this. If you do not shut up, and if the rumors don't stop, and if you don't stop talking shit behind my back, I promise you I'm going to call child services, and you are going to get your children taken away from you. Um, and the reason being is because these people, the one literally lets their underage child have their significant other over and is staying with them at all times they let their child smoke Sm like the vape shit they let their child vape and they also um uh they 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 are how can i say this they're addicts okay they they, they they're addicts uh, not not the child, um, even though they let her smoke weed, too, by the way. Uh, uh, oh, I said her. Shit. No. Why did I say her? It's not even a her. <laughs> um, anyways, 
uh, yeah, they, they let, you know, them smoke, uh, weed, vape, and all that crap. Um, but yeah, like I said, if, again, I know they watch my videos. If the shit doesn't stop, I'm calling child services. I'm done playing games with you people. This has been going on, on and off for six years now. Five, five almost, almost five, no, five years, almost five years. Uh, this has been going on. And these people are supposed to be my friends. Uh, they're supposed to be like family to me. But they're sitting there talking bullshit on me. Um, so, you guys want to call me an asshole? There you go. You done fucked up. Exactly what I said on my post. I'm either your best friend or I'm your worst enemy. Okay? I... I warned you. I warned you. And... I, I warned you that I'm not the person to fuck with. Okay? And y'all done fucked up. That's all I can say. Y'all fucked up. I will always win. You need to you need to learn that. You guys aren't used to having people talk back to you. Where I come from, we handle our own. Okay? Where I come from, if there's a problem, we come kick down your door and we handle it there. I come to you. The only reason why I have not is because my fiance is trying to calm me down. She's trying to keep me under wraps. But I am this close to snapping. I'm literally teetering on the edge. I told her this morning, one more thing. If one more thing is said or one more problem is, 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 uh, has arised, she is not going to stop me and she's going to need an army to hold me back. Flat out. I'm done playing your games. I promise you I will win. Again, guys, I'm lazy, but I played football for 20 plus years, uh, mixed martial arts for 16 plus, and I'm a uh, I'm a black belt. But I'm lazy. I have no work ethic. You literally need to practically kill yourself in order to be in mixed martial arts. Just saying. All right, but <clears throat> I wanted to say that I'm gonna actually end this video right here. Oh, shit. I can't get that one there because ah. the reason why I am making videos tonight is because of this little girl right here. Yes, it is a female. The only reason why I know it's a female spirit in this it's because of writing in here. Okay. The only only problem is I'm not a fan of the name considering the name is Rachel. <laughs> and that is the name of the person that I was with in high school, all throughout high school and all that shit. So literally for six years I was with this person. But and this this little girl has the same name as her, <laughs> but I'm not. <laughs> That's not her problem. Um, this is, for people who haven't seen the video earlier, this is the gift that I got today. There is... I came with two notes and earrings. So, my next video is going to be because of that. Uh, or about that, so... I'm going to end the, the cell phone one I'm going to post first, the um, uh, digital camera one I'm going to post after, you know, later on the night. So uh, this one I'm posting right now. So and it starts.
<laughs> Alright guys, I'll see you in like five minutes. Hopefully this posts fast, so later.